Hey you guys, it's Kima and welcome back to my channel. So I'm coming back to you guys with a style tutorial on this Her Given hair and also an updated review on it. When I made the wig, it was a bit big for me. So I'm hoping like with this twist out that, you know, it'll be a little bit more tame to where I can wear it on set. But other than that, you guys, I'm still in love with the hair. The hair is super soft. Here are a few products that I'll be using on the hair. As you guys know, I have to have my T-pans to keep the wig in place. I'm also going to be using this Shea Moisture Detangler because I'm actually trying to get rid of it. And then I'm going to go in with my handy dandy Hawaiian Silky Activator Gel. Okay, as you guys can see, this brush is gliding through this hair. Like this hair is so easy to detangle, it's not even funny. And mind you, I haven't detangled this hair since I had last washed it. So when I showed you guys the video, you know, of me prepping the hair and different things, that was the last time that I had actually washed it or anything like that. Uh, I haven't um, worn the wig out that much. So I didn't feel like it was necessary to wash it again. And also I haven't been using, I haven't used any products on it actually. So um, this will be the first time that you guys will get to see me thoroughly detangle the hair. I feel like when you detangle the hair with a diamond brush, it makes the hair a little bit more defined. So as you guys can see, the curls are popping. So once I'm done detangling, I just twist it up and then I move on to the next one. Voila, here are the finished results of all of the twists. They look nice and juicy. All right, so let's slap this wig on really quick and then I'm gonna style it up for you guys so you guys can see what it looks like. Hello, hello. So this is what the wig looks like all nice and dried. The twist looks so nice, you guys. I wish my hair was like this thick. I'm trying to get to that point, but I want my hair to be exactly like this when I twist. And this is actually how your hair is supposed to be. It's supposed to be thick from root to end. So this is what you call healthy hair. So my hair, yeah, it goes thick and then it starts thinning out. So I gotta cut a little bit more. But um, yeah, this is what your hair is supposed to look like when it's twisted. So yeah, this is what my wig looked like too on the inside, just like that. Look at these twists, y'all. They look so nice. Like I said, I wish my twists were like this. At one point, my twists used to be thick like this. I don't know if I want to put the bobby pins in now because I'm still going to be like tugging on my hair. So I'll put the bobby pins in once I get done. But it's pretty much secure on my head so it's not going anywhere make sure i have my part where i want it so let's start taking these twists down so pretty 
pretty. I usually leave my twist like this. I probably separate it once because I don't want it to be too big. So this is just perfect for me. That's why I made a bunch of twists too because the more twists that you have, the less separation that you have to do. I probably won't have to do any separation, but we'll see. I made sure I put enough twist in there to cover up any parts. And I actually have a twist video coming out soon to show you guys on my real hair. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to separate it. I like it how it is. I probably picked the root a little bit. But I like the definition. This is normally like how I wear my twist. Like a twist out is supposed to be basically like a twist out. You unravel it and leave it alone. Because the more that you try to uh, pull it apart, you'll cause more frizz. This is what we're looking like so far. twist without me messing with it this is just a fresh twist out my bobby pins along my hairline I only added four I'm gonna go on my eyeshadow palette with my angle brush and grab some of this dark brown mix it in with the black and camouflage the lace So this is what the hairline is looking like right now. I'm going to lay my edges with this Hawaiian Silky uh, Dry Look Gel Activator and a good old handy dandy toothbrush. really loving this hair um, it's probably the best curly hair that I've ever had so um, if you guys are still interested in getting this hair I definitely recommend it especially if you're looking for like protective styles with your twist and braid outs this is like the perfect solution it looks exactly like natural hair I am in love with it and I know you guys will be in love with it too. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. I will have more pictures of this hair. And that's also how you can keep in contact with me. I'm also doing vlogs too. So keep up with me on a daily basis. I'm trying to get with this whole Vlogtober thing. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> so I'll catch you guys in my next video. Peace out.